What's up guys? We see here is a 1989 Casablanca Venus. And um, I got this fan from Air Antarctica from the Fanimation Group made of uh, 2022. Get this fan for I believe like around $50. Um, so this is how I got it. And I, I don't have the, um, the color, or not the color, cover. I don't have the cover plates on right now. So I can show you that real quick. So, right here, right there it says remove this side for blade installation. And right here, you have the information tag. And this is the first year for the Casablanca Venus. This is the first year for the Venus series, and um, yeah, so I'll turn the fan, the lots of blanket on. Let's do demo mode first. I'll try to unplug it. My mistake, let me plug it back in. Now, Let's do demo mode. So we'll uh, fire her up on demo mode. Very funky, 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 sorry. Funky looking fan. I always love these Venuses. Uh, I believe these were discontinued sometime after 1994. I think they discontinued in 1994, maybe 1995. So these do not last very long. And also these were very expensive brand when they were brand new. So you don't see a lot of them. This is the uh, K55 motor. Yeah. I think that's pretty obvious, but I just thought I uh, would specify. And these fans, they are very heavy. When, they're, they're not very heavy, but they weigh about as much as an original when they're fully assembled. So I'm not going to I'll show you the, the light feature. Let me just stop it. It doesn't like dimming up for some reason. I'm not to replace the bulb in it. But here it is with the light. Um, then I'll turn the light off. Here it is on speed one. This thing may need a new BFR as low speed goes pretty slow. I think it's too slow. Or maybe it's just the sheer weight of the blades. I've been looking for one of these Venuses for a while. I'm thankfully, I'm thankful I got one. You know, low speed's pretty slow. It's growing. It's on the original down, so it's not blocking the air. So I'll crank it up to uh, speed two now. And I, I am using the, for those who are curious, I'm using this fan on a W32 wall control. So the blades are kind of difficult to put on these fans. 
I don't think these fans ever saw the XLP motor. I don't think they were made that long. They're certainly a cool fan. Certainly, uh, also I'm also looking one for in black, but this white one will have, this one will do. So I, I love the, uh, I love the look of this fan. And I'll, uh, put it up to speed three. I'm just using a half a day bracket for this fan. It's held up all right. Should probably be using using a, a, a J hook, but it's been up here for about four weeks now, and I'm, I'm not going to have it up here for much longer. So might get a hang screw for it, and then uh, I might put like a stepped hang screw with a recall clip on it because this fan is certainly not safe with a recalled hang screw because this fan's very heavy. Up to uh, speed four. Turn your speed four. It's already moving. Uh, I'm standing under it right now and uh, already feeling a decent breeze. Uh, yeah, I'll put up the speed five. Use speed five. The camera looks like the fence flush mounted. It's kind of funny. Funny someone put one of these on an LCA. Also be a pain to put the blades on an LCA. I don't think you actually I don't think that'd actually be possible. And I'll uh, put up the straight high. So this is just uh straight up just high. I'll take you off the uh, tripod here. I can figure out how to do it. A slight wobble. And the blades make a slight, like, clicking noise. It's just because they're high gloss blades and might over tighten them a little bit. And also down here, the uh, control I'm using. Phone back on the tripod here. Yeah. Got some light on real quick. And now, uh, shut it off. There you have it, folks, a 1989 Casablanca Venus. Thanks for watching.